so welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing an ab workout using no equipment. All you need is a chair, okay? A chair or a stool or something to sit on. So that's really the only equipment you need. This one's gonna be a burner for our abs. It's just under 10 minutes. So it's gonna be nice, quick, effective, and let's do it. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit that little bell. Hit it, hit it. Hit it, hit it, hit it to join the girl gang, okay? And so you can stay up to date with all my videos and we can do the workouts together so you can be one of the first ones to try the workouts and you can follow me on the social medias so it can be BFFs, okay? Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and get into the workout. So we're gonna be doing each exercise for 60 seconds, okay? Especially because we wanna hit those abs, get our waist snatched. I'm resting 20 seconds in between. So I'm gonna go ahead and start the timer. All right, so the first exercise is leg lifts over the chair. So you're gonna go ahead and get down on the ground, hands underneath your hips, legs up, and we're gonna to go to one side and the other side. Going around town. Nice and slow and controlled. Whew. Let's go all the way around. Don't let your legs fall to the ground, but get them as low to the floor as you can. Let's go, one minute of crunches. Feel the burn, enjoy the burn. Let's go, we're halfway through. Keep going, let's finish strong. Whew, oh child. These abs are on fire, damn. Okay, next up we have got chair toe tap. So go ahead and get in the chair. We're gonna be leaning back and we're gonna be doing alternating toe taps. From the time of these. Legs up, so lower one leg and switch. And switch. You're actually being engaged, engaged the whole time. Ooh. <sighs> this is a great one to do in the office once we all get back to work. You know, you're just minding your business, sitting at work or in school, you just lean back and do a little, little bit of toe taps. Oh my god. These are intense, but that's what makes them so good. Let's go, come on, keep it up. We got this, keep going. Squeeze those abs, whoo, and come down. And all right, our last exercise with the chair. We're doing crunch, pumps over and under. 
So if you have a stool, this one might not work so good for you, so maybe do it without the stool, but if you have a chair we you can put your legs into, that'll be good. All right, ready? Go. Under, over. Now let's go. Keep going. Okay. So you can go ahead and put the chair to the side. Done with you. Oh, okay. Next up, we have got a plank. <laughs> These are amazing to build stability in your core, cinch your waist, arm strength. Oh, oh. Let's go. Get into plank position. Make sure your back is completely straight from your neck down to your heels so you're not like this. You're not like this. You are in a perfectly straight line. Ankles are squeezing together. Thighs are squeezing together. Squeeze. Let's go. Keep holding. You can alternate between being on your elbows, getting up on your hands for a little bit, but make sure you keep that straight line in your back. And let's do the last 15 seconds on our elbows. And hold. Breathe. We're almost there. Oh. Okay. Woo! Damn. That minute felt long <laughs> as hell. Next, we've got plank shoulder taps. So these were actually going to be on our hands, kind of like push-up position. I'm going to be tapping the opposite shoulder. So get into push-up pose, and tap the shoulder, and switch. This is amazing for your arms and your core as well. Try not to rock to the side too much. I know it's hard not to, but just try your best. Get to breathe. Almost done. Now we've got one more exercise. Let's go. Don't get. 
give up on me now. Okay, catch your breath. We've got the last exercise. Oh, it's getting toasty in here, isn't it?